What's up everyone and welcome back for more Let's Play Ocarina of Time. In the last time I got the remaining skull blast and I already noticed that there's trouble at Hyrule Castle because the bridge is down for no reason. And even at day the bridge is down, so that's really really weird. Now if you approach the bridge, the cutscene will happen. It's really dark and it's lightning. This definitely isn't good. And it's night. But that's nothing special. Now it remains silent, I guess. It starts raining pretty loud, and this reminds me of something. And wait a minute, the bridge is falling down! In the night? This really, really, really awfully seems a lot like my nightmare. Yeah, this definitely seems a lot more like my nightmare. There is something going on here. It's Princess Zelda with Impa. And she throws something, which looks like a blue ocarina, if I saw it right. And... Oh my god, that's Ganondorf. That's problems. And he's just staring, he's not doing anything, he's just staring around. Ah, I lost her! You, over there, little kid! Oh. You must have seen the white horse gallop past just now. Which way did it go? Answer me! So I'm like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, don't hurt me, don't hurt me, please. So, you think you can protect them from me? You've got guts, kid. Alright, unguarded then. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. You want a piece of me? Very funny. Like your attitude. And he just creates some sort of dark ball, it's like. And. Wow. I stood no chance there, I didn't even. He just throws his hands and like, ha! A fat little the fool, do you realize what you're dealing with? I am Ganondorf, and soon I will rule the world! And. He goes off to chase Princess Zelda, I guess. And for some reason the rain stops and it's getting light again and stuff, so that dude really, really, really is a problem. And I know it. I got a triangle nose by the way. <laughs> Just noticing. Anyways, now it's light again, but the princess dropped something, didn't she? Over there. What's that? Wait a minute, you said the exact same with a bottle and I already revealed it. It's a blue ocarina. So, can I dive it? Of course I can. And... Here we go. We got the Ocarina of Time. The, indeed, the blue ocarina. The royal family's hidden treasure which Zelda left behind. It glows with a mystical light. And... More cutscenes. More cutscenes. Barzgold, can you hear me? It's me, Zelda. Can we communicate through this thing or something? Particle, when you hold this ocarina in your hand, I won't be around anymore. Is that a farewell note, Will? I wanted to wait for you, but I couldn't delay any longer. At least I could have, I could leave you the ocarina and this melody. This song opens the door of time, and that's important. So it's right A down, right A down, and I can sing it along. Like this. Dun, dun. Now this song plays a crucial role not only in Ocarina of Time but also in its sequel, Majora's Mask. You've learned the song of time. This song is really, really, really important. It is probably the most important song in the game. Now, Particle, play this melody in front of the altar in the Temple of Time. You must protect the Triforce. Alright, and for no reason I'm actually out of the water. That's weird. Anyways, there is one more thing which I'm gonna do. Well, actually there are two more things I'm gonna do. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna enter an exit, and... Now if you go to Long Long Ranch with the bunny hood on, you can get rid of this mask, because we still have the mask. So I'm gonna turn on the bunny ears, and look for the... Uh, Running man around Long Long. 
Hmm. The yeah, problem is I have no idea where he is right now. He could be anywhere. So I guess. I think he will run clockwise, so in order to chase him, I'm gonna go counterclockwise. I hope I'm making the right decision there. And I think I see. Yeah, he's over there. He's over there. He's over there. He's over there. I'll just chase him, chase him, chase him. Yeah, it's not like I'm trying you. I'm running here with a sword to that man, and he's just doing his thing. I'll just. Oh, I almost got it. What kind of dude is that? All you have to do here is chase him. No, not slash him. But chase him. But make sure you keep track of him. Eventually you'll stop. And I don't know when this is, so if it takes too long, I'll skip ahead. I don't think it takes that long though. Perhaps if I'm running circles around him, he knows who he's dealing with. Yeah, I don't know. He's like just. He's like running along. I'm like, dude. Like, dude. Like, dude. Yeah, I know. Come on. Come on. I don't know what you're doing. I don't, I don't even want to know what you're doing. And what the hell is that? I wire those things chasing me. And what the frick? Well, they're actually. Hmm. Just shield yourself and you should be fine. So I'll just walk along with this dude and ignore those things. Nobody knows where he's going, but okay. Hmm. Well, whoops. It's almost night. I got a feeling he's gonna stop at night. Can those things just leave me alone? And it's night. But he's still not stopping. I mean, he's taking quite a walk. Can can I can't I just kill those things? Wait a minute. I shield them and oh, he stopped. I bet with those long ears, you can hear the voices. Sell it. All right. Find the actor stage. It's a 50 rupee mask, but he paid you a crazy amount of money for it. More money than you can count. Go back to the mess shop and pay back just 50 rupees of this money. What he does here, he complete, complete, completely refills your money count. So I got 500 rupees now. He probably paid 500 for it. So it's probably obvious what I need to do right now. I need to go to... Um, the... Um, what's it called? Mass salesman, of course. Jesus, I should have known that. The mass salesman... And tell them that I sold the mask, and now if I do that, I will get more masks available. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick my ocarina of time. It's the exact same ocarina, just the only difference is that you know the song of time with it. There is actually a trick in which you can get the fairy ocarina with the uh, song of time, and for that you need to skip the scene with Saria in the beginning, and once you got the ocarina of time, return. So it's really weird. Anyway, I know that it's almost turning day, but I don't care. I'm just gonna make it day. There we go. And the, lo and the torches go out, and the bridge drops. There we go. And into here. Let's go to the mask shop, shall we? Hmm. The mask, the, the mask, the market, however, seems unchanged by the appearances of the Zelda's depart and stuff. It's like the exact same market again. Now, if you. Oh, great! You sold it! Please pay me back 50 rupees for the bunny hood. Oh, yeah! Very well done! All the masks are sold out. I knew I could trust you. As a reward, I will lend you this special mask. This is the Mask of Truth. It is a mysterious mask passed down by the Shika. With this mask you can see into other people's minds. It's useful, but that's scary. Why is it scary? You may find out as you grow older and discover the true meaning of life. <laughs> and by that we get the mask of truth. We can show it to many people. From now on you can borrow any mask you want. Just a phrase. And if you take a look here, I get a Zora's mask and probably Deku mask and a Goron's mask and stuff. And even a Gerudo mask. And I got the mask of truth here. Now if I do that, I can, I believe I can look into people's minds. Yeah, what's your problem? Yeah, it's scary. So. 
The only notable difference is that if you see a rock with the same symbol as on the mask, you can read the um, transitions or the translations or whatever it is on the rock. Um, now there's only one final thing I need to do before I'm gonna turn adult. So, I'll see you once I reach the Lost Woods again. And yeah, I'm just gonna walk to it like that. So I'll see you in a moment. Alright, so we're in the Lost Woods. What you need to do here is go east. Then go east again. Go, sorry, go west. Then go east again. Then west again. And then west again. And we're here again. You should remember this. With the hole somewhere around. Um, where was it? Was it here? Please? Somewhere? There. Now we're in here. Put on the mask and walk forward. And they're like, oh my god, what the hell is that? And they're looking around to that dude, and he's also like, what the heck? So I'm, so I'm just gonna walk to him. Oh, my young Deco Scrub brothers say, you have a horrible place. But don't worry, we will reward you with many Deco Nuts. And now, I got my final Deco Nut upgrade, so I can wear up to 40 Deco Nuts. Which is the final upgrade which we need to get, so... I'll see you once I reach Door of Time. See you in a moment. Alright, so I'm in front of the Temple of Time with an amazing view on Death Mountain. And I'm gonna enter the Temple of Time. This is the first time I'm actually in here. This is the so-called Temple of Time. And what you're seeing right now in front of us is the so-called Door of Time. And if you look here, in here are three holes, which you can't really see. You still can see it pretty well, but... There are three holes here, one is there and the other two are also there. Yes, and those holes actually have place for the uh, spiritual stones. What I'm going to do is... Oh, oops. Play the Song of Time. With the Ocarina of Time and the three spiritual stones in my hands. And that is going to do something. Really, really, really important. There we go. Those are the true spiritual stones. And those will float around for no reason. And then they will place themselves on the altar here. Like that. And because we played the Song of Time there, the Triforce symbol lights up. And with some epic background music, the door of time opens. So we finally did it. We opened the door of time with the three spiritual stones, and now let's see what's in there. Let's see. Particle, isn't that... And she flies, flies over to... The oh so legendary blade. The Master Sword, which will be used in almost every single Zelda game as a really, really, really important item. There it is, with all its might. In the next episode, I'm gonna pull out the Master Sword and see what's gonna happen. So, thank you all for watching, make sure to like, comment, sub, and I'll see you guys soon.